Raise hell, praise Dale. All right, guys, Pondro from Another Day's Walk here, and this is my second interview of an Appalachian Trail through hiker. Start off, just uh, tell everybody your trail name, the date you started, and why you chose to hike the Appalachian Trail. I'm uh, Blue Jeans. I'm from Wild and Wonderful, West Virginia. And the uh, reason why I started hiking is because something I told people I've been wanting to do for a few years and told one of my buddies that I'd do it and he's no longer with us so it's kind of like a memorial thing for him too. So. Okay what's the date you started? I started uh, February 27th of 2020. And you have made it to New York at this moment. What would you say has been the hardest state or the hardest area you've hiked through to get to this point? Well, so far I'd say the hardest was getting to know how to get your pack down and weight and, uh, you know, getting your trail legs, which is, that's, you know, getting your muscles used to walking for miles and miles. So I'd say in the beginning, the hardest is Georgia. And then uh, come Pennsylvania, the last 24 miles is really hard on your ankles so far. I'm sure everybody's wondering, how did you get the trail name Blue Jeans? Well, I, I decided I was going to hike with Blue Jeans for about 150 miles, and well, I learned real quick that it wasn't the smartest thing to do. Now, switching out of the Blue Jeans, is there any other gear choices you've made to improve your hike since you started? Uh, I had two-pound boots. I went to Trail Runners, the Danners, uh, 2650s. Uh, it went from two pounds to 12 ounces, so that was a major difference. And then uh, from military issue gear to uh, lightweight gear like pants, I got the officio, uh, officios, I don't even know how to pronounce them. They're really lightweight. Uh,